Thanksgiving. Uh, today we're going to be doing another cooking with clat. You know, it's been a little while since we've done that, but we're going to make a uh, we're going to make a Thanksgiving special edition. And uh, just fair warning, I'm terrible at cooking, so that's number one. I've never worked with any of these foods in my life, cooking wise. So I'm definitely going to mess this up. But let's let's get into it, right? We're just gonna we're gonna try to see what happens. Some, some ingredients we got here. I uh, picked up some pre-made uh, classic stuffing, marshmallows. I got some cranberry sauce. No, sorry, this is a squash. We got another. We got a butternut squash, an acorn squash, sweet potatoes. Nice little, nice little bowl of yams. You know, I'm a baller on a budget. I don't got money to shell out on, on kosher turkey. You're gonna have to use your imagination. Be like, oh, look, it's turkey. So there's a chicken in the back. So we got, we got all of our fantastic ingredients right here. We're looking at them. We're, we're smelling them. Smells like Thanksgiving already. Not really. But let's. I guess we'll get into it. We're gonna try to, we're gonna try to make some food out of this. Step one is we're gonna steal one of my mom's. Last quick the trace because I've seen this go in an oven before and uh, hopefully it doesn't burn or explode. So I have kind of an idea going in my head. I was going to start off by just basing the, the ground with marshmallows. This thing and just marshmallow it up. Just start off like that, you know. That way when, when it melts, it's marshmallow, all right. Well, we'll have a little, nice little coat. Take whatever this thing is, and we're gonna we're gonna just start placing yams around. Um, now that we got our yams and our schmello, I guess we'll we'll start with this turkey chicken. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I just uh, I just washed up my kosher chicken, good and ready to be devoured. I forgot how chicken like raw chicken is. Look, look, it's got little wings. Feet. Ooh, that's gross. <laughs> Which way is chicken supposed to be on the on the thing? Uh, as you can see, there's a little hole back here where the uh, the good old anus would be, and we're gonna, we're gonna stuff that hole. Wow, that is a it's a whole chicken, huh? That is a whole chicken. <laughs> All right, so I've never I've never actually made stuffing before. So I just bought pre-made stuffing. So we're gonna look up in the instructions on how to make this. I guess what, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna lift this guy up and just kind of stuff his butt. I'm sorry, man. I, I know you didn't probably think this is how it was gonna end up, huh? Should have invited you out to dinner before this happened. I don't know. <laughs> it looks so. <laughs> it looks disgusting to be completely honest. And use the yam syrup. Flip this birdie. Just kinda yam him up. Can't can't pick that one up right now. Stuffing a chicken butt. Well, okay, so the next step is gonna be we're gonna lather our we're gonna lather our chicken turkey with cranberry sauce because cranberry sauce is the meaning of Thanksgiving, right? So we got our can of cranberry sauce. To be quite frank, that looks disgusting. So we're gonna go a little caveman here and Take care of this turkey, you know, a little massage. I keep saying turkey, don't let me, don't let me confuse you. This guy, this, this is a chicken. I can't answer the phone right now! All right, so, you know what, honestly, okay, to be completely honest, it doesn't look amazing, but it doesn't look, it looks like something, it looks like someone made an attempt, and that's really all that counts, right? Well, I guess we'll cut up this butternut squash, acorn squash, and sweet potato. Acorn squash, huh? I'm gonna go to the gym lately. Oh, wow. Okay, acorn squash, I dig it. Butternut squash, I don't know how to go about this, so I'm just gonna get him right at the shaft. We'll just put this guy, should, should I be pushing them in? I wanna make everything compact, is that what the goal is? I don't know what I'm doing. All right, that looks, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, girls and squirrels, 
This looks like a Thanksgiving feast, if it wasn't for me. This could feed an army of men, let alone a dog. Look at that, so now we got our Thanksgiving turkey chicken with the stuffing, squash, potatoes, yams, marshmallows at the bottom, croutons and caviar. No caviar, actually, I lied about that one. Hey, come on. I'm gonna be completely honest though, you know, this smells pretty good. It doesn't smell bad at all. All right, you got your turkey. We're gonna pop it in the oven for... All right, ladies and gentlemen. I popped it in the oven at 350. I figured out it was a broil, it was baked. We're gonna have it in the oven. We're gonna chill for three hours, four hours. I don't know, I'll check on the chicken constantly because I'm scared this thing's gonna burst into flames because I don't know how to do this. Hey guys, so it's been three hours uh, approximately and we're gonna pop it out of the oven right now. It smells incredible. It smells really good, but it looks disgusting. Um, the, all the marshmallows turned completely brown, kind of looks like gravy. And viola. There's our Thanksgiving turkey kosher chicken with caramelized marshmallow. <laughs> and I don't even remember yams. Alrighty, let's have a taste now, shall we? I would be lying if I said I wasn't scared because I'm a little bit worried. Hmm. It's not a, no, it's not bad. It tastes, it tastes Thanksgiving-y. Okay, yams came out excellent, but I didn't really have much a, much a job in cooking those. Class, can I tell you something? This came out good. This actually came out good. We have a whole Thanksgiving feast done. It was delicious. I'm, I'm proud of myself for making that. I mean, it could always be better, so let's hope for next year we'll make a better recipe. But it was decent. For just throwing that along with no recipe, no nothing, I think it came out pretty good. So I wish you guys a happy Thanksgiving. I'm really thankful for you guys sticking along and watching my videos and helping me out all the time. It means the world to me. Love you guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Let flats. Boxer, so I'm just in my real, in my real natural mode right now. Okay, so let's begin talking about some stuff. 